Morning guys, I'm George Troop here with the last European morning call of the week uh, before we head into the extended Easter break. The markets have been open in Europe for about an hour and a half. Uh, so let's have a look at what's been going on. And you can see here that uh, equity markets pretty much across the board have continued their rally from this week. Uh, the DAX here is up about a percent and a half, 1.4%. Um, you can see that it started down at about uh, 10,460, up at, uh, to around about 10,550 uh, at the moment. Um, and all of this, we're thinking, is based on market, um, market hopes that the corona pandemic is reaching a peak um, interestingly we've got US unemployment claims data out later today uh, so that could have quite a big effect expecting that to uh, jump again the last two readings of course were pretty much records with 3.3 million uh, followed by 6.6 .6 million that could rise by another 5 million today um, up maybe even reaching the teens the unemployment rate um, so we'll have to see uh, what happens there. Uh, there's also a Fed meeting. Uh, J Fed Director Powell is speaking uh, later this afternoon as well after that data comes out. Um, if we look back at the Dow Jones, uh, you can see it did, did rally yesterday as well after Bernie Sanders... Uh, dropped out of the U.S. presidential race, um, so that did have an effect there. Carried on this morning with the futures, so that looks like it might be opening higher later today. Moving on to commodities, I'll just change the chart here. Um, just have another look at this huge um, oil rally. Jumped again yesterday uh, after more news on the OPEC meeting, which is currently ongoing. Uh, it is starting to feel like any kind of move for a deal has already been priced into the markets. Remember, we were down at around the $20, $20 a barrel mark um, just a couple of weeks ago. Uh, that's now up to around 30 as you can see here. Um, so we'll see if the deal between Saudi Arabia and Russia is agreed. Uh, there might not be much of an effect if it's already been priced in. Uh, however, anything that the markets aren't expecting is likely to have a huge effect. Um, so we'll likely have some more news there this afternoon, uh, since they are currently uh, holding a video conference, all of the OPEC Plus members. Um, that's it for now. We'll be back later today uh, with more news on OPEC, more news uh, on US unemployment. Um, so, yeah, keep an eye on the chats and thanks for watching.